Today we're gonna to talk about possessions and age in French and the verb you need to learn to easily be able to communicate about those things. In case you don't know me, Rochelle DeMeo, your native French instructor from Valtier Academy. So in one of our last lessons, we talked about describing oneself and describing others using the verb être. Good job, I can see that you retain the lesson. Well here, there is a verb that you're going to want to memorize to talk about possessions, any belongings that you have, and to talk about your age. And it differs from English. Do you have any guess what that is? Super. Le verbe avoir, the verb to have. Talk about our family, maybe how many children we have or how many siblings we have. Well, we're going to use the verb avoir to have, but we're also gonna use the verb avoir to talk about our age. And I'm gonna give you a little tip on this one because this one's a challenging one for English speakers learning French. What? So first let's dive in, let's learn the verb avoir, you can repeat it with me, then we're gonna talk about its use, okay? Yes. Donc répétez, j'ai, j'ai, tu as, tu as, Il a, il a, elle a, elle a, on a, on a, nous avons, nous avons, vous avez, vous avez, ils ont, ils ont, elles ont. Elles ont. So as I mentioned in the video where I was talking about how you would describe yourself using the verb être, and make sure you check it out in case you missed it. Uh, I mentioned that using those visuals and using your hands can really be beneficial in memorizing it. And obviously repetition counts, right? Yep. But um, we use the verb avoir in different ways. The first way is to talk about possessions. I'll give you an example. J'ai un chat. Elle a des rayures. Elle s'appelle Skyly. Elle a 14 ans. So what did I do in those sentences? The first thing I did is that I talked about a possession, so to speak, a cat I have, right? I mentioned a few other details, such as that she has stripes, elle a des rayures. Almost it's like something that belongs to her. It does, right? Another thing is that I mentioned her age. Did you catch that? I said, elle a 14 ans. She has 14 years on her. That's kind of the way we word it. So we're not saying she is 14. We look at age as a possession, like you own up to the years you have, right? So we also use the verb avoir to talk about age. So use it for possession. Any possessions, any belongings you have, you could use it for certain descriptions if it's things that you own, such as elle a les yeux marron, okay? She has brown eyes, so it's like referring to something that she owns, so to speak. And then the age. So anytime that you're wanting to talk about a person that's like somebody that is your possession, so to speak, for instance, you have a friend, you have a family member, you have a pet, well, you're going to use avoir and you're going to use it to describe those different traits that they may have. Let's look at a couple more scenarios. And what I'd like for you to do, if you haven't already, is to give me a thumbs up because you've learned something out of this video and subscribe to the channel. 12,500 subscribers are already watching these videos, but you know what? 94% of you guys aren't even subscribed yet. So go ahead and click that subscribe button for me. Okay, here are two examples that you can think of of how you would use it for you. Pierre a une famille. Pierre a une femme. Pierre a deux enfants. Pierre a une voiture. Sa voiture a quatre places. Pierre a un travail et Pierre il a 43 ans. Voilà. So with the verb avoir exclusively, I was able to use just that one verb to talk about so many parts of Pierre's life, right? So that would be one example that you could use it. You could have another example, okay? Alors, euh, j'ai une amie et elle a trois enfants. Euh, elle a deux filles et elle a un garçon. Euh, 
elle a 39 ans. Cool. So that verb comes in so handy. I would love to know what will make your learning of my native French language easier for you. Comment below what you want to learn. This video is actually dedicated to Brittany, Brittany, who asked me to make a video on talking about possessions and why we use avoir for age. I hope that clarified it. But comment what you'd like to learn and that will be the video I will make for you next. A bientôt tout le monde.